Babuhai, Annyeonghaseyo, Akkosi Jinyong. Babuhai, Akkosi Taka. Super hot right yeah, now in Manila. Really hot. Actually, we just finished our lovely lunch. What show are we gonna do after lunch usually? Dessert. I mean, at least in the Philippines, right? Yeah. I thought Koreans really love dessert, especially right after meal. But right after I came to the Philippines, I started to change my mind. They are crazy. I mean, they, everyone really loves to have dessert. I mean, it's like yeah. a daily routine for them, I think. So then, do you know what is Filipinos' most favorite dessert? What is that? <laughs> okay, of course, like, there are so many kinds of oh, yeah? desserts for the Filipinos. But I can say one of the most popular or like commonly known like dessert would be halo halo. Halo halo. Yeah. Halo. Yeah, <laughs> yeah kind of like that. Halo halo. H A L O. To be honest, even though I've tried like other kinds of desserts such as Lecha Plan or like yeah, Mango Lecha Flow. Plan. Yeah, right. Yeah. But I've never, we've never tried Halo Halo yet. Yeah, true. So we are gonna go to the one of the most famous restaurant where you, where they serve okay. like Halo Halo. There is a restaurant as well. Yes, like it's like small restaurant, okay. but still. So let's find out how it tastes like okay. and let's tell let's us our honest opinion yeah. about it. Okay, ready? Okay. Ready. Let's go. <laughs> Tala. Tala. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Tala. Woo! They're still selling like chicken, fried chickens, and like fried rice. Like Chinese restaurant or something. Because there are Chinese characters. Yeah. True. Small. Small. Too, too small. Oh, what is this? Um, mai. It's a dim sum. I mean, I was wondering like why they're selling dim sum as well. So I thought at first this is like a dessert mm -hmm. restaurant, but basically they're selling foods as well. Yeah, right. It's, it's like really Chinese food, right? Yeah, maybe this one is yeah. more like Chinese food Chinese style. Yeah, seriously, many kinds of dim sum, fried chicken as well, and like soup. Oh, interesting. Some noodle. Yeah, have noodles, it too. Maybe. Here we are. Thumbnail. Okay. <laughs> There's the ube ice cream and what is this? I think lecha flan. Oh, that makes sense. So gorgeous. Jellies and beans. Uh, yeah. I don't like beans I to think be honest. Sweet beans and like cherries maybe. But is there rice inside? No. No. It's ice, okay. right? Not yeah, rice. Ice. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Quite similar with the kakigori in Japan. Yeah. I think. Same. Like bingsu. What is the halo halo? Wow. I have no idea. I thought right? really like saying hello yeah, to hello each other or something. Happy, happy or something. So, so I thought it's like very well, welcoming stuff. Like oh, yeah. hello, hello, come, 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 like this. Mm -hmm. No. So what's the meaning? Mm -hmm. It's mix, 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 mix. Oh, oh, mix, mix. So what are we doing? This correct actually. Yeah, it's right, correct. So we're yeah, doing good. We're sitting really and eating, right? Mix, mix, makes sense. But for me anyway, this purple color looks quite weird to be mm -hmm. honest. Because I'm not used to that purple like ube or stuff. Mm -hmm. well, let's try it. Yeah. I like it. Like coconut flavor, right? Coconut, yeah, mm. coconut flavor, that's what I'm saying. This tastes more than what I expected. Oh, true, yeah. Yeah, yeah, true, really true. Personally, I have mm -hmm. had a prejudice on Filipino desserts, which means it's going to be really sweet. But yeah, mm -hmm. it was not. Mm -hmm. I think many foreigners would like it as well. Because mm. if it's too sweet, yeah. because some foreigners really or some people, it. right? But it's not at all. Yeah. So I really recommend you guys to try it as well. How much is it? Around 60, 70. 60, 70. Yeah. I mean, price is nice. affordable, and like the taste is nice. And the portion is big, so mm -hmm. why not? Mm. You guys have to try it as well. Oh, happy. There is the Japan as well. Well, how was it? For me, really same as kakigori actually. I think Japanese, everyone likes this kind of taste. And then there has like many of things like ube ice cream and then the Japan. Much more gorgeous than kakigori actually. Oh, I because kakigori is just plain syrup. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> For me, actually, my teeth hurts. Oh, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm getting old after Halo Halo. It really reminds me of Korean dessert I used to have when I was a child. That's called Bakpingzu, like with shaved eyes, but we put red bean on it. Basically it's similar. Oh, yeah, but similar. The yeah. only difference is maybe like Halo yeah. Halo has more content and like their milk is more like coconut milk. Yeah, and sure. it's quite rare in Korea, maybe in Japan as well, yeah. right? We so, don't put it in coconut milk actually. So I'm pretty sure every Korean would love this. Yeah. Okay, so when you guys have a chance to come to the Philippines, yeah. I really recommend you guys to try Halo Halo. It's like really sweet but still like balanced and like tasty. Like at a good price, a good portion, and many content inside, everything's perfect. So yeah, really hope you guys try it. So thank you for watching my, my video. Yeah. Please and don't, don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to like my video as well. So yeah. I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye bye.